Albert, let's bring you in and talk about what should yep. be a chilly evening ahead for us. Yeah, the coldest temperature, though, for at least the next 10 days. Okay. We don't have anything this chilly in the extended forecast. That's the good news. But yeah, here we go with a freeze likely outside of Chicago and just enough moisture that some frost will even be on the ground and maybe even on your windshield if you park outside tomorrow morning in the suburbs. So freeze warnings in effect. Northwestern suburbs, the rest of the area with that frost advisory outside of Chicago as we start our day in the 30s and we'll mild things up in the afternoon. Want to tell you about the weather alert that we have now in place for Friday. Chance of thunderstorms and heavy rainfall. New data coming in. You see that there on the left coming in, suggesting maybe some of the heaviest rainfall comes in late in the day on Friday. And then another opportunity for heavy rain and even severe weather to wrap up the weekend on Sunday, particular Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. But under a clear sky, it's getting chilly. Already a light freeze. Michigan City at 32. It's 32 Waukegan. 37 degrees right now in Chicago. A little milder though at Midway at 39. And we'll stay above freezing in Chicago. But notice outside the city, a light freeze in the forecast as we head into tomorrow morning and after a cold start in a few clouds, we'll look for a sunny afternoon and a milder afternoon compared to today stuck in the 40s today and we'll be in the 50s for tomorrow unless you live away from the lake. You'll be in the 60s for tomorrow. Lakeside temperatures staying in the low to mid 50s, including 55 at the loop, 52 in Waukegan, 56 in Gary, but a nice 63 more than 64 degrees in Joliet. We're dry tomorrow and then here come the rain chances on Friday. 80% coverage, especially late in the day, not as wet on Saturday. Keep your plans on Saturday. There'll be a few showers around, but the big headline Saturday, not the rain chance, but the big warm up 78 and gusty south winds and then shower and thunderstorm chances back up to 70% coverage on Sunday afternoon and evening thunderstorm Sunday could even be severe. So here's a look at the wide perspective 7 a.m. on Friday. We're dry in our area and this little storm system delayed just a bit. We'll look for the best chance of rain to come in late afternoon into the evening hours on your Friday. Some heavy downpours will be possible, especially in the far western suburbs because of that area of low pressure. We're going to be in between weather systems on Saturday, so strong southerly winds, upper 70s, a couple of showers around, but not a washout on Saturday and then Sunday a new system System comes in out of the southwest, and this is the one that could bring us an opportunity of severe weather late in the day Sunday. Large hail damaging winds, even tornadoes, going to be something we'll have to keep an eye on across the Midwest. We'll keep a close eye on that forecast in the coming days. Tomorrow, though, we'll look for the sun to be out once again, mostly sunny near 60 degrees. Those rain chances ramp up late in the day Fridays, downpours possible, showers and windy on Saturday, and a weather alert. The chance of severe weather on Sunday. Mm, we have some weather to get through. It looks yes, like. we do. Yeah. Thanks, Albert.